Hey there, welcome back. It's Cindy Courtney, your independent Sensi consultant, and I'm here today to share with you January empties. I have some empties here that I like to share with you every month. Um, give you an idea of the products that I love from Sensi and use on a regular basis, and maybe get, give you an idea of products to try out or scents to try out that you haven't tried out before. So let's get started. All right, let's start off with non-wax today because I I feel like I always do wax first. So one of the things that I used up in the month of January is my car bar here, and it is in the scent Christmas Cottage. It's a perfect holiday scent for, I think I had it in there for November and December because it was such a strong scent and lasted such a long time. Um, and finally in the middle of January, I decided I probably should change it out. Actually, I've been using my Scentsy Go in my car and I like that too as well. But um, So I used the Christmas Cottage. It is a plastic rubber here and they say they last for 30 days, but I think some of them last a lot longer. And then it's on the stretchy cord that you can put around your mirror or wherever you want to hang in your car. So that comes in a bunch of different scents. And I just love Christmas Cottage. It's a great holiday scent. Another item that I used up was a scent pack. Actually, my kids use this up. They love scent packs and their buddies that they have, and they have many, many buddies. Um, and they changed out one of their buddies because they said it wasn't smelling anymore. This one is in Sugar Cookie. Still has a little smell when you put it to your nose, but not as strong as when you first get it. These last about three months, but again, I think some scents last longer. And so, yeah, we changed out the scent pack in the Buddy. Which one was it? I think it was the Robot. Yeah, so this is Sugar Cookie. And again, those come in a bunch of different scents, and everybody, everybody <laughs> comes with the scent pack of your choice. And then, of course, I used up a counter cleaner. I love my counter cleaner. If you watch my videos, then you know that. I use this on a regular basis and always have one in my backup for when I run out of a bottle. And this one is in Coconut Cotton. And I love this scent. It's a great scent. I don't believe it's available in this scent anyway because it was a summer smell. Um, but I love the counter cleaner in any scent. I'll take it in any scent. But coconut cotton is amazing. It smells great, so your house doesn't smell like cleaning products. Um, it just smells amazing. And it also has an enzyme in it that, um, as you use it, helps for grime not to build up as quickly. And I think it works awesome. I've used it on my stainless steel. I use it on my countertops. I use it on my oven. Um, I use it on my table. I use it in the bathrooms. So it's a great... Um, product. I love our counter clean. All right, now I just have wax left here, and I didn't go finish off as many bars as I normally do. I still have quite a bit here, but I didn't finish off as normally as I many usually do because Bring Back My Bar was going on in January, and so I was trying out a bunch of new and different scents from the Bring Back My Bar collection that I hadn't tried before. So you'll probably see those bars next month or the month after. Um, but one bar I did finish off is Spiced Berries. This was the scent of the month a few years ago, um, I believe in September, maybe even October, maybe November. But it's a great berry and cinnamon and clove scent. It's perfect for fall if you love the berry scents. It is no longer available, so I had been hoarding this bar for a long time and decided finally I should use up the last couple cubes um, and try out other scent, make room for other scents. And then, of course, I used up a blueberry rush. You know I love blueberry rush. It's my favorite, one of my top ten scents. It's just an amazing blueberry scent that brings me back to childhood with strawberry shortcake and all those wonderful memories. Um, it is no longer available as well, but I do have some bars on backup so that I can use those when I'm, I'm in the, really in the mood for blueberry rush. All right. And then I believe I used, uh, let's check and see, yeah, I finished off two blue Christmases. Each one just had a couple cubes in it. Um, this is my favorite number one holiday scent, even above Christmas Cottage, which I love. It's just, it's, it's an amazing Christmas smell. It smells like, you can smell the orange in it, the spruce, um, maybe even some cinnamon or other spices. But this is my favorite Christmas holiday scent. So I finished off both of these and I have one bar for next year in case it doesn't make it back or come back in the Seasons collection because that was what it was a part of, was the limited edition Seasons collection. And speaking of the Seasons collection, I also used up Cranberry Tinsel. This was one of the scents available in the 2017 collection. And it is a great cranberry scent. You can also smell like some pine in it maybe or spruce something along those lines I don't have the descriptions anymore in front of me but it was a great holiday scent when I was in a berry mood 
And then I also used up Sugar Bells, which was also part of the collection. And this is a great bakery Christmas scent. If you're, I was, when I was in the mood to warm uh, bakery scents, but not in the mood to bake, <laughs> I warmed this. It smells like an apple crisp to me. You can definitely smell the sugar and the butter, and I think some apple in there maybe. I could be wrong, but that's what I smell. And I also have a backup of this for next holiday season as well, because I love it so much. Okay. Um... I used up a Simply Rose as well. This is from when it first came out um, in the collection. I had bought one when I saw it was retiring and had been hoarding it. Then when it was in the Bring Back My Bar, I was able to pick up a few more because I love the smell of Simply Rose. If you love the smell of roses, you would love this scent. There I go, throwing my clamshell like I do every video. <laughs> um, it's just an amazing smell. It sm reminds me of a perfume I wore in high school called Tea Rose. It's just that perfect rose scent. So I definitely picked up more of these when it was available last month. So I have some more of that. And then I finished off a melon and apple granita. This was the scent of the month last February, I believe. Maybe March. I'm pretty sure February. But it's a great fruity scent. You can smell the melon in it and the apple. It's just a great scent to get you in when you have the winter blues and you're tired of all the cold and the winter smells and so that's why I finished off this one. This again is not available any longer but I needed to make room for all the new scents that are going to be available next month. And then the last two bars that I have are scents of the month. Vanilla Mint was a scent of the month for January and I use this one to make samples. I do have my own bar that I'm warming but haven't finished it off and it is a crisp clean smell can smell the vanilla and definitely the mint and then the, there's citrus in the background which makes it really nice so that's a perfect scent for the winter time when you still want winter scents but maybe not the cranberries and the spruce and all of that and then February scent of the month is plum and white woods and I use this one to make up samples but again I have my own bar I'm warming kind of hoarding because I need to get more already because this is a great smell it's a definitely a romantic scent it's girly to me. Um, you can smell the floral in it. I think it has plum. Oh, I have a description right here in my flyer. It is sweet raspberry preserves and damson plum weaved through vanilla orchid. So it you can, it's just an awesome smell. It reminds me of Sunny and Cher and maybe even poppies and clover, which is another scent I love. So those two together, if they had a baby, that's what this would smell like to me. I love it. <laughs> um, so I, I used up another one of those. So those are all my empties for the month of January. I um, love my wax and my counter cleaner. I can't wait to uh, share my empties with you for next month. I, this year is already flying by. Feel free to share down below in the comments the items that you used up in the month of January and what your favorite fall and winter scents are. And if you need any help with any orders or um, any questions that you may have, feel free to contact me. And until next time, have a sensational day. Bye.